This is the Transformers Generations Titans Return Deluxe Class uh, Sergeant Cup or Cup with his uh, Titan Master or Headmaster Flintlock. The figure is part of the fourth wave of these Deluxe Class figures for the new Titans Return series of Transformers toys for Transformers Generations. And here is the packaging. Very nice standard Titans Return packaging. Look at that pose. <laughs> It comes with a nice collector card for Flintlock and Cup. And we've got a standard instruction sheet. Okay, let's get him standing up. Um, I was very excited to get a cup because we got we got Hot Rod. And if you watch the 1986 movie or the Come on man. Uh, you'll know that Cup is one of those popular one of the lead uh, role, one of the lead characters in the movie, and it was awesome. He was that veteran Autobot soldier that was trying to give tips, pointers to the young soldiers like Hot Rod. And I really love his role there. And, being, and I've been meaning to get a decent cup for a long time now for my generation shelf. We, the G1 cup is well, it's okay, but the robot mode didn't really impress me. So it wasn't really, you know, I didn't ambition to get that as a kid. A G1 cup, but we've gotten several. Uh, we've gotten a Generations cup that was a more Earth mode, um, um, uh, alt mode, which reminds me I should have gotten that one. I didn't. I'm sorry for not picking it up, but you know what I'm talking about. And this one, uh, I think this guy, that cup looked okay, but I think he was too armored up in ar in robot mode. But this one, I thought he was a little bit too bare. In robot mode he looks like a cross between blur and cup more like a sentry on Cybertron a younger version of cup in, in fact that's how I'm, I'm seeing this guy the head sculpt looks like the old cup we know kind of kind of does but the I'm sure to I keep saying Takara because Hasbro's colors are off it should be like that but for some reason they used gray and I'm sure Takara is gonna make that blue um, I love the idea of Cup, but this guy just seems too, too has too little armor. He should have a little bit more or something like bigger forearms, big show. I, I don't know. There's just something off about his robot mode. And again, the colors, the colors are somehow mismatched. It kind of evokes Cup, but it's not a perfect um, color scheme for Cup. I don't know. It's it, it it's a lot better than the Hasbro blur Hasbro blur issues on it, but. What can you do? Anyway, he's got these two. Look, let's say he's a younger cup. He's got the... But in the bio, I don't think he is. Yeah, Sergeant Cup. Anyway, um, so he's got two blasters, which are absolutely cool. They look like uh, the ones they used for a the Alien movie. Or Aliens. They kind of look like that. I got that vibe. And you can connect them, form a bigger, like a two-barrel gun, which is pretty cool. I'm hoping they do another cup for the Target Master series of... Since I don't recall him being a headmaster. So that's that. Uh, our t uh, paint apps, I, I talked about it. It's, it's just okay for me. This is more of the cup, I remember. But this type of bluish green is a little bit off. I, I don't know. It's, it's like a shade too dark. I don't know. So articulation has got a ball-jointed shoulder. It can go up and down as well. Another hinge joint. Bicep swivel double jointed elbow because of transformation and some hinge wrists because of transformation waist swivel because of transformation ball jointed hips thigh swivel hinge knees and some foot articulation because of transformation so here is flint lock okay very basic we'll uh, keep him in a seated position because that's how he's going to sit inside the cockpit now transform cup pull the fists this way and fold up the arms like this i know it's like a it's like a oh my god hot rod i know <laughs> sorry about that um okay uh, open this up oh fold this down That's the front part of the cab. 
Um, rotate the waist. Bring these up here. Pull down the feet. Untap these. And then they swing all the way up here. The transformation seems flimsy when you when you're getting to it, when you're just trying when you're starting it, but once everything tabs into place, it, it's it's pretty solid. Um, so there's there are tabs right there for these notches. And just do that. You don't worry about that, it'll all line up once once you get everything done. And then uh, these tabs in together. Sorry. Practice, this was fine. Okay. cup in his semi futuristic or cybertronian truck mode which is i think he was a, a cybertronian truck uh in in the in the movie and this is i think the closest we've gotten to him since g1 the g1 toy and take nothing away from the generations toy it was it was good but i think this is a more representative cup of our generation of the g1 generation one cup and there's flintlock and even the cockpit is sort of like cup it's just a little bit short should have been a little bit longer you know what i'm saying about this figure it, it's almost as a perfect iteration of cup but there's just a few bits and pieces that you know should have been done better and i'm hoping takara can do a much better job than this just just a few um improvements would have made this a very superior um uh rendition of cups as it is i'm gonna give it a nine out of ten i like cup there's some bias to that should have been an eight but because it's cup it's gonna get a nine out of ten there you go, folks. Hope you've enjoyed this little video review. This has been the Transformers Generations Titans Return Deluxe Class Cup, Sergeant Cup with Flintlock. Thanks for watching. Oh, by the way, let's do this. And there you go. You can also sit Flintlock there if you want me to put him over here. Do that as well. You can have Flintlock sitting right there. Thanks for watching.